outside in picture frames. I see my beautiful wife always smiling, but on the inside, I can hear her saying, Lead me with strong hands. Stand It's always a joy to dedicate young children to the Lord, and it's a special joy to be able to do that today on this Father's Day. So uh, normally we dedicate babies or infants, and today we've got a young man that's a little bit older than that, but uh, this is the first opportunity that the Alberts have had to have MJ dedicated, and so they ask if we could do it on Father's Day. So that's what we're going to do. So Maria, if you'll bring MJ, Michael Lewis Albert Jr., You'll bring him up, and Michael, if you'll join us, please. And while Michael is coming to stand here with us, you guys can just stand side side by side here. The Bible says this, after Hannah had delivered her son Samuel, she kept her home with him until he was weaned. After he was weaned, she took the boy with her, young as he was, and brought him to the house of the Lord at Shiloh. They brought the boy to Eli the priest and said to him, As surely as you live, my Lord, I am the woman who stood here praying to the Lord. I prayed for this child, and the Lord has granted me what I asked of him. So now I give him to the Lord. For his whole life he will be given over to the Lord. And he worshiped the Lord there. And it's in this spirit that Michael and Maria come to bring MJ to be dedicated this morning. And what we're going to do is I'm going to ask them some vows of dedication, and they're going to pledge themselves to keeping these vows, keeping these promises to MJ throughout his life. 
Michael and Maria, since God in his wisdom has chosen to give into your care, MJ, because he wants godly children, will you now pledge yourself to do everything in your power, God helping you, to be the kind of parents that raise godly children? Will you give yourselves to be growing followers of Jesus in order that you might be a consistent example of what it means to follow Christ in all you say and do? If so, say we will. Will you guard your marriage, knowing that the best thing that parents can do for their children is to love each other well? If so, say we will. Will you pray for your son that God would be at work in his life, drawing him to himself, and that his eyes would be open to see God's glory, that he might come to the place of full surrender to the Lord? If so, say we will. Will you raise your son in the church that he might not only love Jesus, but learn to love his people too. If so, say we will. Will you establish a home that is full of grace and truth where your son can be nourished knowing that he's loved and valued and grow up in the training and instruction of the Lord? If so, say we will. You want to have your part too, don't you? Mama. Mama. Oh, there we go. Yeah, she's out there, isn't she? Will you? Finally, will you raise your son in an environment where there are open lines of communication and realistic boundaries enforced by loving discipline? If so, say we will. All right. I want to just pray for you guys, and then I have a certificate of dedication that has all these vows on it so you can be reminded, you know, five years from now, ten years from now. And when you graduate from high school, you can pull that out and see how you did, okay? (laughs) Let's pray together, shall we? Father in heaven, I thank you for MJ and for his life. I thank you that you have entrusted his life to Michael and Maria, and I pray for your grace to be multiplied to them as they raise him to love and serve you. But I just love to pray the Lord's Prayer in these situations. I pray that in this home, your name would be honored. I pray that your reign and rule would guide this home and that your kingdom would come and your will would be done there as it is in heaven. I pray, Lord, that you would give them what they need for each day, patience, love, courage, discipline, consistency, I pray, Lord, that you would help them to forgive as they forgive others, that you would forgive them as they forgive others. I pray, Lord, that you would keep them from temptation and deliver them from any attack, assault of the evil one. And now, Lord, in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, we dedicate MJ to you and we dedicate Michael and Maria to raise him to be a, a man of God, a man marked by Christ. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. God, God bless you guys. Here you go. Here's a certificate, and I've signed it, and there you something to keep reminded you. Let's uh, let's celebrate with him, shall we? There you go.